Mumbai Jokopu. I've been baller, Pippi Rimpy. Hey, man. Pippi Rimpy. She got sugar. She got sugar. Hi, guys. So, this is a weird kind of something. But I have someone that's sitting down with me. I decided to drop. Bros. I decided to drop. I decided to behave yourself. I decided to drag him to say, come, say, let's do mukbang. Or let's just, you understand, video. Jack, when you have famous people, you have to use them. I used Bisola last time, I'm using this person. <laughs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. My name is Toby Barkery. It's not Life straight. On this mukbang. That's the swag of it now. Angles. I, I, I'm, I'm lost. All right, guys. Um, my name is Toby Barkery here doing the mukbang with somebody else. We'll I, was I was gonna say, say some naughty things, but let me be. So, do we set this down or are you going to hold it the whole time? Just leave it. So, guys, we're here to eat at Cactus. Your camera is selfish, like, it's only you that's fine. <laughs> we're here to eat yeah, at I'm Cactus. Struggling. And, um, yeah. Or is it this angle? Over your cup full. They do. We're actually here to eat, Sha, so let's see. I don't know what we're going to order yet. This is what the menu be looking like. Man, plenty, plenty. I don't know if I want to do breakfast menu or um, Ooh, you know. Oh, eggs always look good though. Yeah, but does it taste good? Who knows? I don't have what I usually have. That's the pasta. It's, ah. it's, um, something. Look at oh, this. Cool, letting us know that you do come here Look quite this. often. Mac and cheese and. That's that's gross. That's juicy. No, that's gross. Juicy Anybody stuff. That. Anyways, they, they don't have sea bass. They don't have what? Seabass. Oh she, Yankee boy. Seabass. Come on. Ah! Oh, we're going to the travel. What is this where they land? They move. They were here. They Seabass in Lagos, Nigeria. But there's a restaurant that has Seabass. But it was. How <laughs> much it cost for that Seabass? It wasn't it was the Seabass they brought. <laughs> it was like, like, you know that <laughs> titles from like middle of the ocean. <laughs> Anyways, while we figure it out. We're just here. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. How's your birthday though? We'll be back. How's your birthday? How's my what? I love your mom. Like her mom dropped on her birthday, her yeah, mom was her mom be dropping gems. Totally like, fell in love with my mom. So. Like straight up, it was I don't know it why. It was instant connection. Oh was it? Yeah. Like your mom had like deep talk and I liked it. But a lot of what your mom had to say, she, if they say if we say it on social media, hmm. go cause fight now. Hmm. All the tables will be broken. Because wow. everybody is either a feminist or a masculinist. All, all them ladies, like a lot of people come out in support of, a lot of people come out against. So but me, I've already said, man, whichever you choose, whatever direction you are staying, just you know, follow it religiously and with clear conscience. Don't make sure are you really happy? Toby, would you do a long distance relationship? I've tried and it's not working. Why didn't it work? I'm a very physical and it's not like I'm needy, I'm a very physical person. He's so needy. I would always want my girlfriend to give me attention. I always want to have access to her. Though I don't like too much. Don't, mm, I'll so give when you say access, you can call her, you can text her. It's not the same. I want to be around her. you. I want to go out. I want us to go out together. Oh, okay. I'm you get, I want to come back home to you. If I'm having so a rough day. So you intend to be living with your girlfriend? No, not necessarily. But okay. like if, I'm, if I've had a rough Option. day, I want to drive to your house and just sit down and talk. Okay, fair enough. On the weekend when I'm not doing anything, I can just come and sit in your room and just help you pick out our space for the week. Yes, yeah, stuff like that. And you can Shango, always come to my you'll space. You come and pick outfit for the week for you. Yeah, <laughs> like I, I, I do this, and I sold female clothes when I was in NYC, so I have great taste. Wait till you know, sir. Great taste. <laughs> <laughs> my mouth, that is so. <laughs> so yeah, but I, I long as I could actually met a girl in Canada. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Everything was. Shout out to you, girl in Canada. Girl in Canada. Mm, everything was perfect, like perfect, perfect. So now say she did Canada. But distance. She get Bali. No, because me, I'm like, she, get she gets now. But me, I'm like, my business is here in Lagos. I can't relocate to Canada. Do you understand? And me, I can't make you relocate to Nigeria. Go. I can't no, make you. Don't, don't say that. I don't. I, like, she, I think the. I yes. think it's fine, but I think where you might have made a mistake is when you say you can't make someone. Nobody makes anybody do anything. I won't, I won't even let her. Dating, I won't let her. Remember, she feels like I won't let there's her. a future in your. You can't say you won't let her. her because it's her choice. I know, but I won't let her. For her to she's choose a, to want to, it means that she probably has weighed she's, all her she's options. A nurse. Her ballet. It means that she's probably weighed all her options, and she thinks the fact that first of all being with you is important to her. 
she's also been able to say that i would hope logically to be able to say that she can still thrive in this same nigeria that she might want to move back to but my point is you can't make that decision on well, half and half but i won't lie even me that's why like i won't let her like if i have my way i won't let her because how much are you earning as a nurse in canada in london in the us you're earning good buck yeah you? but it's not about the money sometimes people want happiness people have money yet they're not happy you now come to nigeria because of so, man that you like that means that you were not committed enough it's not her. committed I, no you are not trying to it's not that see because, if, I, if i have a sister that you travel and relocate because of man, man, man but what if that's the you? man that's meant to be her husband that she's sure of husband that, that, baby no that when, when it comes to relationship and everything it's compatibility Mm -hmm. a lot of so you just said that you and this particular it. girl had okay, that okay oh yeah let's talk let's talk um she moves back to lagos uh -huh. um in the course of spending time we all know our relationships can be um ups and downs smiles and frowns it things but probably wait yeah. wait now things don't probably work out uh -huh. you get, this girl eventually moves back because oh okay i found love note not as if nigeria is better mm -hmm. not as if she's very sure of what nigerian future holds for her mm -hmm. but because she feels she has found love mm -hmm. and all that so the years down the line or let's say even like just even say years down the line something happens and relationships scatter kilo day that's that's like yeah but either or it will be a hard decision that she chose to make so even if she might but i like her, it i like her enough not to let her choice. i like the person enough not to let her make that kind of decision and but then you might have been letting because go that, that could have been great but i'm that, not saying trying to say when you're dating someone someone needs to move that probability about is too much that probability but if she is saw much. the fact that you people could have gone further in future and she wasn't ready to move yet obviously until she maybe she got some form of commitment i either a proper engagement ring Either a proper engagement ring or she got like a man marriage. Then I was looking at Bombo now that she clapped. I was like, "Dilo," but I won't lie. I mean, I, I, but look, you look at it. Will you, will you leave? Okay, so oh, you do long distance. No, I can do long distance. Okay, so let me ask you now. Because I like my face. Let me ask you now. You see a boy in America. Uh -huh. You like him. Uh -huh. He's doing okay for himself. Uh -huh. You will leave your current job. Because no, but that's what I'm saying now. I'm not. I, so even I if you see future with him. No, but that's what I'm trying to say. I'm not saying that she should leave her job because she sees a future. There needs so to be some form of stability. Is what I'm trying to say. What form of stability? For example, if I meet a guy in the Oboro, you understand me, and I'm thinking that okay, you know what? There's probably something there. I'm not going to carry my bags first and move straight to Yankee until I get some form of solid okay, so if you're commitment. If, so if, 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 if we're now engaged, that means that both of us are at that point where by wait now, we have decided that, okay, this thing is important to us, this relationship is important, we see a future with each other, then we start to banter, how can we make it work? Okay, G, my job is here, the kind of work I do, I love it here. Can I still be able to do the same thing there? Depending on the kind of job that I do, the flexibility of it, okay. But all right, maybe we might have to find out where we can do. You know, my point is that's when you now start to do compromise and you start to have conversations. But while you're just dating somebody, I don't think dating is enough reason why, which I agree with, to just carry your bag and move. Yeah. I said dating. And and you know even in the course of the length or the strength of a relationship mm. i'll tell everybody there if they've told you not to sleep in your man's house before getting married you are shooting yourself on the i better shut up sorry let me just tell not, you not let me sleep. just let me i can understand allow me shut land. up allow me land i can understand allow sleeping land. over allow me land allow me land sleeping over allow no me land. moving allow me land allow me land we are land see trust me um what you what you know spending a month in someone's house living with the same person if you like spend two five years this in the person you won't know as much what you will see within two weeks of living with somebody you would never see it in five years i'm can, telling can I, you can i say something so uh -uh, you need to can i say something what you're saying says. okay now we judge things in different levels you said anybody that will tell you not to sleep in your man's house you can't do sleepovers i, I don't do sleepovers wait. live together mm -hmm. for live together before you get married live when you together. say live together live together is relative some people can say live together is every other weekend i'm at your place no that's not that's together. no that is it was two days you just said if what you will say in two days no, no i said i said two weeks two weeks two weeks <laughs> bro at least spend my point my point in is, two days i can still hide a lot of things no. now it's weekend my I point is my age. point is anybody that wants to hide will still hide my cousin was married to her husband for 20 years Eventually, her husband is married to her best friend. Her best friend then was also married. Wait, they were living in the same house. My G. Her best friend was neighbors down the street. So you guys, you her see, husband is now married to her best friend. You see why some women are stubborn. It's trust. And her best friend was married at that time. It's not so, as if she no, experienced it. It's somebody that experiences it. And that no, she's but the point me. I'm trying to make is this: yeah, but I, I feel like there's me. nothing wrong with spending time together. There's nothing wrong with the occasional we travel where together for a week. Hold on. But in terms of maybe because of my faith and my belief and my morals, 
I would not move into a man's house. You're not moving married. into now. Mm -hmm. You're but just you're, saying the same you're spending thing, two weeks in his time. house. Spending two weeks in his house. You said a month, bro. Yeah, a month. I think I'm moving into a man's house a month. What's wrong with my place? I pay rent. It's not that. It's just that you get this. I won't like it. And I won't like it. Also, wait. Even if you like the guy like that, you like the guy like that. Yeah, it's really good. You can still not know someone after spending a year with the person. You can still not know someone after spending 10 years or 20 years. What I'm saying is, you will find out more if you live with the person. Like, I still want to hide, they go hide. Like, how you gonna know if they change boxers? How you gonna know? How will you know if she's changing Okay, so what if for those two weeks? How you know if What if for those two weeks? You change pants and boxers just for you. Great. Then by the time you come out again, you go back. Exactly. Let him do it for one month. You will catch him now. As a man, how will you know where she used to spread her pants? Because some a lot of things I, I would mean, like when you live with some when you live with someone a lot of things will annoy it will no, upset I agree you. with that. I agree like when that. it comes to that sharing space, you know that. at that point it's no more oh Romeo and Juliet, oh take ice cream and take no, so no, you're no. inside the same house. You are when you're like, tired, you're not tired. Talking, tired. You don't I'm understand. You someone now you now go to the bathroom, your so, water is dripping. I agree. It's a sapata. I agree. It's a sapata. I agree. It gives you some Ah. Form of exposure to get to know the person a better lot. and on a different a level. On a different but what I'm also trying to on a say is there's still no guarantee, even when you do do that. So we have to also be very. It's not guaranteed, but it's a better option. Cautious. It's a better it's option. It's not a better option. See, it's the just minutia, an option. the minutia in this thing yeah, oh is. My God. Sorry, I just learned that word as you use it. The minutia. In this <laughs> the minutia. So the thing is, there is levels to it. It will definitely, definitely give you a deeper level of understanding of your. Partner. Not deeper. I might just give you more insights. All right, guys. We are gonna Please play now. Order food. <laughs> we be back. So they brought our first. <laughs> so we ordered this. So what did we order? I ordered them um, seafood pasta. No, actually, it's prawn and chicken pasta um, with a lot of cheese, and you've got the garlic bread. So we're right now ready to dine, ready to dive right in. Like, I'm starving. Like I waited. You know, I stayed hungry all day. Is it? What kind of act is this? Um, you know, um, L American accent. Oh, is it? <laughs> London American accent. Right. Um, you lots hear that, yeah? It's London American accent. It's a L American accent. He doesn't even have to speak with an accent, but it's okay. So I ordered a gin basil. Very strong. Not strong, it's more like gin and tonic-ish. With basil leaves. Roche, gin basil. Pronounce it again. Gin basil. Basil. Is it basil? Basil. Don't hate on me. I, I don't freshen up. <laughs> Bro. The ghetto has left the boy. Whoa, whoa, the boy whoa. has left the ghetto and the ghetto has left the boy. Now, Are you from the ghetto? I grew up in a rough neighborhood. What do you mean rough neighborhood? I grew up in Shomulu Pedro. That's not a rough neighborhood. And Oguduroke. That's not that's not a rough neighborhood. That's not rough? No. Really? No. Shomulu. It's not a rough Shomulu. neighborhood. When you say rough neighborhood, I'm making a joke with it. Nah, nah, nah. I exactly. Didn't get it. You had it pretty good. You didn't get it that bad. Yeah, I didn't get it that bad. Yeah. I, didn't, I never claimed to get it that bad. No, I don't have so fast to right now. What just happened? They turned off the music. But what did you say before? You said they could not turn it off. It's in Nigerians. But I think now. Uh, maybe, maybe they're, they're changing, changing the track. music. <laughs> 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 yeah, let's dig in. I, I hate the plating, by the way. Plating is all good. Like, it doesn't even make you want to eat food. But yeah, so Toby, what's good though? All of a sudden now, you've gone from BB housemates to like, mm, super it's more movie star. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think with acting, I never actively thought I would love it. Like, I, I've only done a lot behind camera. Mm -hmm. So, the first time I had to do it, I just wanted the opportunity. It was more like, okay, stay relevant. Um, DSTV is giving you opportunity in hustle. And I'm like, okay, well, act. Because at that point, what I told myself was, anything you think might be interesting, try it. If you don't like it, then you stop it. Makes sense. But after my first few scenes, <clears throat> was challenging. Mastering the lines was tough. But then when I started to get a hang of it, I started to enjoy it and I loved it. Like I used to look forward to being on set. I loved set food. Wow. A lot of people don't eat set food. A lot of celebrities don't have really like set food. Me? Don't mind them. You say a lot of celebrities. Who are the celebrities? Yes, I'm not, if some of y'all don't eat set food. I used to love the set food they buy in the morning, the pop and something in the afternoon, they're going to ask. Sorry guys, please don't come for me, it's mock bank, so I'm eating. <laughs> Jeremy, 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 forgive you. Mm -hmm. she, do, she does mock bank every day. <laughs> 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 so yeah, and after the experience, and then I got to work with the likes of Shob Shola Shobowale. And he name would, dropped him, by the way. Yeah, I had to drop it. And like, she would mention comments like, I want to get there, it's acting well. 
So my mind, I'm like, oh, I'm like, yeah, I got it. So beyond finding it interesting, I got commendation from people I kind of look up to and that, yeah, you should pursue this, you should do more of this. Mm -hmm. And even from my performance, like every job I did was marketing for the next job. So it only good. They only went to show or goes to show. Like, okay, you got you got skills, brother. So I'm still brushing up, and you know, eventually, what else was Sugar Rush coming in December? You know this. I played the role Andy. Don't know. I also have Fix Us. That's a Evan Nelson movie out first week of December. Sorry, could, could, hate, could you be hate. quiet here? Yeah? Uh -huh. All right. How about this spaghetti and towel? They don't tell, forget it's not even banging. It's not nice. It's not banging, but it's okay. It's basic. <laughs> it's better than anything I'll ever make. Dear future Bill, pardon me. <laughs> Are you single? I don't know how. Are you single? This is not professional if you won't ask me. Yeah? I can't switch it out. <laughs> Answer. Are you single? I'm single. Are you searching? I'm available. Single and available. So you never search. No, it's not that I won't set. I'll position myself enough to be found. But no, why wait, wait, you, so you feel men should search? I don't feel men should search. I feel both parties, male and female, should strategically make sure that they position position themselves enough to let the other sex know that if you do feel the need to want to approach me, mm -hmm. you can because no. I'm available. Meaning I'm open. That's my problem with that. What's the problem with it? That position will be like packaging. No. Oh, if all of us position, position. No, no, no. The yeah, position I'm talking about is not position. It's not like um it's not like um um faith without action. That's not what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. Do you get what I mean? Meaning that you know go just stay here. You go to see fine boy, you go to look fine boy. Fine boy go to look you, nobody go move. Mm -hmm. That's not what I'm trying to say. So what's your position then? Position in meaning that if I'm sitting down here and I see a good looking guy and he's looking at me and he's giving me signs, I can walk over and say hi. That doesn't necessarily mean I went to search for it. I don't know if you get what I mean. I, I he was able to get the signal that ah, I feel you. might seem interested. But I feel the you. reason why I say that is because I'm a firm believer, me I'm Christian. And the Bible says he will find a wife, finds a good thing. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. So that means that a woman should be sought after. Mm. Doesn't necessarily mean that she should wait mm. and just be in her house there. And expecting someone to know that in this house there is a single girl, so let me knock on the door. You need to make yourself available. Hence why I always say I'm single and available. Please show us the Don't pizza. Don't worry, show us the... <laughs> Look at this. Oh my god. Oh my the focus. god. The focus. Look at that. Yeah. Ah, barbecue bees off. I don't know who's gonna hit it, but it's okay. Mm -hmm. Take it away. You don't know leftovers are the best. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> Look at you. We got defeated. This mukbang was, um, this mukbang was, was a failure. It was. Because yeah. we did not finish the food. Wasn't that great? Uh, he chooses not to agree. Do you think you can date someone in the media space? Me? Personally? Yeah. I wouldn't want to, but I've learned that in this life, as much as I say I don't want to do you something, can't say never, I should never say Close never. Your mind too. But I would prefer not to. But then also, let's realize that the media space is huge. So it can be that like the media space media you're talking now. about front is media. You know the camera, media camera. Things. No, I, I don't want to. It's not. I don't find those kind of people. I think the same. No, and, I, I, but I don't. This one I can say. This I don't close my mind to. You. I'm like, for if me I to be say. Behind the camera, maybe you are a producer. <laughs> but my point is, you are an actor, a I, musician. I think she's saying that Nigeria. because I think she's saying that because she knows how much actors make. <laughs> So, uh, even me, like, say the whole media space. I would like, I would like, say the, say the whole media, whole media space. You like, say we are shaking. Yes, now, say the whole media space. I'm like, I know for a fact, except I see someone extraordinary, and it can't just be media you are doing. So, that doesn't even have money. any finance. <laughs> <laughs> I used to trade currencies and securities, man. I have my CFA level one and Come, like, like, come on, don't play with me. Okay, I graduated with the two more. Like, oh, okay. <laughs> Just, just putting this out there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I won't lie, for me to do this one in media, that means ah, you are spectacular. Oh, that I, just, I can see if I tell you wouldn't. that you are different. I just so. wouldn't. Because I might talk, I'm actually quite introverted, but can be extroverted. I don't want someone louder than me or loud or such an attention seeker. Just, yeah, and I, I think I there's, just like, there's a lot of packaging. Because I don't like attention. There's a lot of need to keep mm. up. I don't like it. life really. There's sometimes that I need to keep I me. Mean, I don't stress. I, I, like in a way, I've gone to that point where I don't stress it. But how am I sure she has the same reality? I want to write like, a joke. Huh? 
I want a regular guy. Mm. I wouldn't mind one too. When I mean regular, I mean like you know. I want to, I want someone that is crazy, crazy psycho. Like, but yeah, like, but those people. guys don't give me attention anymore. I think the fact that I became a celebrity or public figure, like I didn't notice until recently, mm -hmm. like in recent times, that people see when I meet people now for the first time, they see me different. The me I think they see is not what they what see. They see so the person, they already have impressions in the back of their head. They already have. So like someone on a normal day when I was in the bank, they would talk to be like, oh look at this cute, nice guy. Now, oh celebrity he wants to, he wants to sharply use celebrity for me. That, yeah. Don't mind him more. This one, I bet this gist. Which it gist? happens. Which I feel like gist? it also makes you very defensive, and I can say that on my chest because I remember there was a time, some like a month ago, I was at the gym and um, a guy walked up to me and he was like, hi, sorry, yeah that. Right, and I was like, No, I'm not that actress. And he's like, Okay, I'm sorry. What I said, like, Yeah, what I do is I'm a this, 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 this. I'm the head of this, 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 this. I was like, Oh, I just only knew you from Skinny Girl in Transit. I was like, Yeah, but I do a lot of but I'm not that. But you can imagine when they meet you, that's and the so only thing in their head. That's like all they see. Skincare. And I feel like sometimes I always have to let people know that I'm just more than that. And I feel like sometimes it's, it's also. Cold because I can imagine people that that's all they identify with and they're okay with that, which is fine. I'm, I'm just more, and I'm not ashamed to say that because I'm so much more than just Tiwa. Just that. Tiwa. So, yeah. Tiwa. Andy. Okay, okay I did. I did. Oh, Tiwa. <laughs> Remember, when I'm like, ah, do we have a new middle name? <laughs> like, no, it's the show. Okay, okay. So yeah, I feel like but that thing is messing me up, man. Judged. That thing is messing me Constantly. up like crazy. Like everybody yeah. just has the impression. Like because I'm young, single, they don't believe Playboy. No, I think they will constantly always do it, regardless of, and it's not your job too. And I've realized that try right to prove on. anybody right or wrong. I think what you can do is just one step at a time. People that get to know you get to know you. Love. I need love. We all these need lonely love. days. <laughs> The, the days get lonelier, you know. You, go, you, you go out with friends. That way I don't have to carry it to the office. Do that. I said, come and take cheesecake from us. That way I don't carry it to the office. Oh, voila. Like, lonely oh, days. Lonely, lonely is ah, it's real. It's real. I said like, it before. Sometimes yeah, I just yeah. really want to be in the house with one, my one person. Like, I travel. wake up in the morning, go to gym, go to work, work on stress matter, come back home, and I'm just by myself. I can't remember people want to say I want to call to say that and say okay let me come to your house or sure you stop by I'm just feeling or someone would send you ah. send to you that is so sweet cold loneliness and cold though it's a master I can't even lie and I think the older you get when you start to feel like there's certain things in your life that are falling into place you start to want and you start to long you have carried me to another conversation you know in our society now I won't lie it's as if so women are starting to so men and women decide to do the one I don't understand. You know, you know how by the time they are like 50 and 60, they act like, oh, it's still all about my career, it's still all about my networking. Uh, I'm like, man, there's that age you get to, bro. You no, know, where you want someone now. It's not, it's not even where you want someone, it's more like where nothing else matters but your own. And in your own, I mean your family, your probably children or your spouse. Because a lot of people try to downplay it now, like, oh, eh, right now it's not it's not that important anymore to be married, to have a family. I feel it is, because generally in life, there's going to be that point, man, nobody's cutting it anymore for you. All this, you already know all this hello hi in public. It's just hey, it's just hello hi. Like to you yeah, are inside your house talking to your husband I don't even or like talking to your children. Sometimes I'm actually learning. Oh, I'm getting to that point where I'm starting to accept and understand that some people generally don't even want that. Don't ever want to be married. Um, or, to be honest, or have kids. Have kids like just. It took like, me a while to not only acknowledge it but also even respect it because like you have people like that. Yeah. I know some women that don't ever want to get married or have kids. And to me, I couldn't, I couldn't stomach it because I feel like, like women are raised to be natural. No, not, not so young, though, women not, that, young, not young. Yes, yeah, even grown. Yeah. This same grown, women, grown. Yes, this same women are saying this, but yet they have cats and dogs that they love with their entire life. So I'm like, so you definitely do want to you still want something. your love to something. But now you're Why directing you it. A person. But then I've learned that see, people are you never of, understand this. I don't think it's actually bullocks. I just realized that you just never know their history. Maybe they've been hurt before. Yeah. Maybe they really and animals are easily people. controllable. Like you can control your dog, sit down, is. stand up. Some, stand people, up. some people can't lose that control. And because they don't speak, yeah, some people, they just feel loyal. But and I think you know, there's some people that just can't lose that control. They always must be. So anything that would threaten control. Mm -mm 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 -mm. And they're kind of crazy people. Oh, you do? Men like that always hit people. Men, women yeah. like that always hit men or just like Or insult the men. Yeah, verbal abuse. 
Well, let's not go into that. <laughs> it's a whole nother yeah, conversation. I'm, but I'm but so I think it's tricky. You know, you never. You know, for me, I believe in. I don't. Number one, I don't like to put my mouth in relationship matters. I don't because, ever. Because, it will bite you in the ass. Because ash. what people don't know is, for every action or for every reaction, there was an action. So in every situation, except I'm open to having where the where it started from mm -hmm. and how we got to where it was. I don't mm -hmm. even like to interfere because yeah. a lot of time, like in the house, especially for some people are more emotional than others. So for the man, he might not really be saying what's pinning him. Do you understand? Some men don't know how to deal with women that are more successful than them. Yo. So they are fighting with that in their in their mind. This so this level they, of success they, the one is not necessary in terms of cash. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it can just be just the prospect of the fact that this person is just Better on a than larger I am, a platform level. than me. It's crazy. I don't know. Mm -hmm. So me, I just like I think it's content. Mm -hmm. Because regardless, if you're, if you, whatever you have, if you are always happy okay with, it. with it. I mean, me, like I broke. Like I always told myself, like thank God for my parents. If I was a conductor, I'll have been like the conductor everybody loved. The Asheru conductor, the Soji conductor. I'll have been the. Oh, if I don't come to the garage, you know, I'll be that. Well, the fact that he's just a prince, he embraces it. No, so like I'll, I'll have been that guy. You get some like many. Anywhere I am in life, I'm always going to choose to be happy because you, we are always going to want something. But where you are, uh uh. Why not be happy with it? It's important. A lot of people want to be where you are. A lot of people will kill to be where you are. And you want to kill to be them dangotes, but you know. Yeah, but where you are, we are all not going to be dangotes. We are all not going to be dangotes. We are all not going to be dangotes. We are all not going to be not all of us, so me, I'm, I'm an angel. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're yeah, so Because there are things that are just going to, me and God, we converse, you know. You said, no, my, now you talk to God. No, it's in the book, so. <laughs> God wrote it to my desk, okay, lay. For my liberation. You got to blow. Come my, on. For my liberation. Yeah. Come that's on. That's why I'm like, this media, you know. You will stand before kings. You know, that's why I'm like, the media is a platform. So now they know me. So what am I doing with they know that they know me? Now it's for me How to How are you making impart, differences? How are you impart into their life. You get me? See, I'm selling my market. Come up with wisdom, Bellory. See, I'm just 25 years old, but wisdom, where me? Oh God! Please break it down in English. What did you say? And what I just said was, uh, you know, I'm I'm quite young, but I'm kind of exposed mentally. So, and that's because I talk to a lot of people like this. You know, when you like have to talk to them, you kind of just get like your brain might be like this, but it just poofs like. And when it when it poofs, like it just continues. When it poofs. 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 You just continue like expect like let me not go into it. <laughs> this accent, guys, it's on this note here. We finna say bye because Ra is going mad right now. Yeah? But Smile. we tried a mukbang. Oh no no we have to pause. This pause is going to be for the uh, for the montage. Yeah, we have to look for pause. Another one. <laughs> no, no, like <laughs> Dead. Sun vanity. Another one. Ah, that's a good one. Another one. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, take care. Peace out. Spread love. Oh yeah. Tell me why. If you wanted more hits for you. More love. More